All right, time to take it apart and see how it looks. Hopefully we haven't glued too many parts together. Kind of just breaking these away as much as I can. by just putting the chisel with the beveled edge down, letting it slide underneath gently, pry, and break that away without digging the chisel into the, into the marine ply. and using a backing board so we don't drive the back of the hammer into the plywood. Once that's done, see it with this plastic. Lift the rest of the nails. And let's see how we go. We've done this right. Nothing is glued together. Nothing's glued to the table. And there you go. Two panels done. We'll carry on with the rest. with all the panels removed from the workbench. It's going to give each one of them a light sanding orbital sander with 180 grit sandpaper. Most sanding is concentrated over the puzzle joints to remove any residual epoxy on the plywood. Once the sanding is done, we'll just brush off all of the dust or take the air hose and clean everything off in preparation for rolling out the fiberglass. So this is one layer of four ounce e-glass, 50 inches wide, which just covers the five panels and it need not come all the way to the end. Basically the eight foot table is where the glass will end, the end of the boat We'll have other structural components in there, thereby not really needing uh, fiberglass reinforcement in that area. And once the piece is cut, we'll just uh, remove the roll of fiberglass away and tidy everything up. And the best way to do that is uh, not with your hands because if your hands are like mine they're pretty rough from woodworking and they tend to catch the fiberglass so I like to use a large dry brush which I use particularly just for this purpose when smoothing out fiberglass 
And with the fiberglass nice and smooth, we're ready for the first coat of epoxy. And thank you for tuning in. Uh, be sure to subscribe to follow the rest of this build and other videos on Arca Boats.